Welcome to Breast Thermography International. We'll start off with some startling facts. There are about 207,000 new cases of invasive breast cancer in women each year. The chance of a woman having invasive breast cancer is about 1 in 8. Breast cancer is the leading killer of women ages 35 to 54. There are 47,000 women that die under the age of 50, and there's $12 billion spent on breast cancer for research per year. New research has shown that mammograms may be causing cancer. The conventional detection method is an anatomical approach, searching for lumps, bumps, tumors, etc. MRIs, ultrasound, x-rays, and mammograms are considered conventional detection. It is either a situation where there is a tumor or there is not a tumor. Breast thermography, on the other hand, detects physiology instead of anatomy. They may detect tumors up to 10 years before a mammogram. There is no radiation and is safe at any age. Mammograms took 25 years to approve as a standard. It's an anatomical evaluation, like we said, searching for structural abnormalities. It does, however, emit ionizing radiation and may be painful. 80% of biopsies are negative, and there are 20% false negatives with mammograms. Both of these lat latter two statistics are according to the NIH website. This is a picture that shows both grayscale and color images of a thermogram. If you notice on the middle row of gray pictures to the right, around the left breast, there is a surrounding area of gray vascular patterns. This is highly indicative of cancer and is very pertinent to what we are looking for with breast thermography. If you look in the color rows on the same picture, you can see where that same vascular pattern shows up as red and a little bit of yellow, indicating it's hotter. We can actually measure these temperatures with our software and compare them to the opposite side. Our images are at the top of the screen and our competitors' images are at the bottom of the screen. Notice the difference on the same patient in the contrast, clarity, and color of these pictures. Breast thermography has been FDA approved since 1982. It has been around for about 40 years or more. In 2008, according to a study by the American Journal of Surgery, written up by the American Society of Breast Surgeons, 94 people who were biopsied and compared to thermographic studies, 60 of the 94 biopsies proved to be malignant. And out of those 60 malignancies, 58 of them were identified correctly on, on thermography yielding a 97% sensitivity rating. If you were born before this date in 1990, then you need a thermogram. They are safe at any age without radiation, and anyone 20 years or over is recommended to have one. You can get more information or sign up for an appointment at www.btiscan.com. You may also call 1-877-315-SCAN. That's 877-315-SCAN.